Hi, I'm Emmanuel Sandu, and I'm here for OlympicsOrBust.com. So, Emmanuel has skated before in the Olympics, but what do you think of witnessing Vancouver 2010 this year? What do you think is, have been some of the highlights so far? Well, I went to uh, the men's free skate yesterday, so that was definitely a highlight uh, for me. It was a very exciting competition, and just the fact that they're in Vancouver is pretty exciting. Exactly. You're telling me, and I totally agree, Johnny got completely ripped off. I thought he deserved to be marked a little bit better. Um, some people might say it might have something to do with his personality and who he is. I don't know if that's valid, but any thoughts on that? Uh, that's exactly what I thought as yeah. well, but yeah, I don't know why that would enter into any equation on the ice. And Evan Lysacek's performance, wow. Yeah, I mean, um, I was, <laughs> no offense Evan, I love you, but no I was offense. I was rooting for, for Plashenko simply right. because he's done so much for the sport of figure skating, um, especially in, in, in the men's discipline, and uh, you know, it just would have been exciting to see him get like another gold medal back to back, but I thought Evan skated cleaner, um, yeah. you know, and uh, you know, it wasn't unfair, you know, yeah. it was it was the right result, and uh, that's all I can say. Good for Evan, he's an amazing competitor. My hat goes off to him. Exactly. And I loved his costume. Oh, yeah, it was so great, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was I cool. want to be him for Halloween. All you need is, like, a rubber snake or something. Well, well you might have to add a few <laughs> Swarovski crystals. <laughs> <laughs> might need to talk to Vera Wang, but, uh -huh. yeah. So, what is your opinion on this whole, we're at a big Olympic recognized party in an Olympic city for GLBT community. Well, frankly, I think the Olympics is a big party. <laughs> it is. It right. just becomes the center of the universe yeah. uh, for the two weeks that it's on. Everybody just ends up focusing on on where it's at. People come from all over the world to watch it and to support uh, the athletes. So you know, whether it's straight, gay, brown, white, whatever, you know, it's yeah. all a big party to me. I think it's just great that you know we're here. We're here doing it together. Okay. Who do you think are some of the other really sexy Olympians out there? <laughs> I think to be an Olympian is to be sexy. Good answer. I love that. Yeah. It's the same thing Mark Tewksbury said. Um, I don't know if a lot of the American viewers know, but I just got off uh, season two of So You Think You Can Dance Canada. Oh, cool. awesome. Uh, and I was top three boy. Congratulations. There. Yeah, so obviously uh, that's definitely something that, <laughs> you know, I'm not sure if it, if it would be part of the Winter Olympics, but maybe it could be part of the Summer Olympics. It was like a mini Olympics to me. I mean, the work that went into that, seven days a week, right up yeah. until the end. The last week of the show was just was just incredible. So, yeah, that's a little bit of something that I've been up to lately. Well, it's totally right up my alley because other than dancing, you know, I, I'm, I'm moving into sort of the music uh, venue, I guess, of my life, if, if you'd like to say that. So I think, you know... MTV, you know, it's just, it's yeah. pop culture, and I'm all about pop culture. Which artists are you a big fan of? Well, duh, Lady Gaga. <laughs> of course, I almost put the words in your mouth. Uh, How about Adam Lambert? I do like him. Um, I like David Bowie. I like Bright Eyes, um, Smashing Pumpkins. My tastes are all over the map. Obviously, there's restrictions about which songs you're allowed to skate to, but um, Johnny, we already took Poker Face. What's your dream song that, like, if you could skate to anything you wanted, what would it be? Well, I usually choose one-off pieces that uh, very few people or no people have used before. Uh, for example, uh, when I competed at my last games in 2006 in Torino, I had uh, my free program was composed specifically for me. So, you know, just something that isn't generic. I just hate seeing and hearing the same things over and over again. Ew. <laughs> Ew is right. Ew, gross. Who wants to see that? No, I, I don't. I just fall asleep, exactly. you know what I mean? It's just so not me. Yeah. <laughs> gross. Cool. Hi, I'm Emmanuel Sandu, and what do I say? <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> and I'm here I'm for... I'm an athlete. I didn't say I was a brainiac. <laughs> you can for... be both. Come on.